Hello, my souls, and welcome back to Into the Radius. And today we're going to be turning in a couple missions. We're going to see about getting some stuff done. And Well, I'm, I'm just going to try to be a little less uh, spazzy while I'm out there in the radius. So first things first. Let's deliver this little beauty, and it's the neon. I have no idea what that's for, but oh well. Gets me 300 bucks. Another delivery. Have a camera. That one gets me that. Uh, by the way, uh, you guys will notice a couple things that are different here, at the very least. Uh, you will soon. Ooh. Okay, so first things first. Let's go on in here. Let's go get ourselves a uh, mission, shall we? Uh, there's one that's top priority. So, Explorer, there was an attempt of data breach caused by one of your predecessors. We entrust uh, you with recovering the files left behind by... Or in Bolotsky Village by a fugitive, uh, fugitive explorer number 58. The spot is heavily guarded, so get prepared. Okay. If that's the case, I'm going to take some food. I should probably bring a medical device of some kind. Do I have any? Wait, do I have any injectors? Do I have any med injectors? I have some soap. I believe I have med injectors over here. Hello, phone. Uh, you know what? I think that's all the med injectors I have, so... One of the other things I'm going to bring is uh, going to be this little baby right here. Just in case I need it. I'm pretty certain I'm not going to need that one. thought my cigarette went out. Anyways, I've got my sidearm. I've got something special shell to show you guys. I'm going to get off into the uh, radius here. So, I'll see you guys out there. <clears throat> okay. For logistics reasons, use the shortcut from Belusky to the facility. Guarded by a seeker. I have no idea what that is. No idea what that is. But we're gonna head to head to the facility. And you guys know I have a bit of a surprise for you. Well, you remember this little be uh, little beauty. Well, check out what I found last time I was here. Now, this little beauty is an SMG. So if I get into real deep shit, it's got a semi-automatic uh, mode as well as a automatic mode. So that's a thing. <clears throat> Let's get into this, shall we? I'm gonna head this way. I probably should be checking in front of me when I do this. And I'm, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna drink that. I've been relying on cigarettes for quite a bit now. <clears throat> now, I do have essentially 70 shots 
for my SMG. I'm going to be using it on single fire because uh, I've got a 35 clip here, 35 round clip, and a 35 round clip in the gun. I'm going to be using it as a single uh, as a single shot uh, weapon for the time being. As an FMJ box. <clears throat> okay. It's gonna look a little weird for you guys when I'm aiming, because I am aiming using my dominant eye, which is my left eye, and this thing sadly records from the right eye. I can try aiming down the sides with the right eye. What I'm doing right now, so you guys can probably see the crosshair. Or not the crosshair, the uh. Hey, motherfucker! Oh, I'm an idiot. Come on, guys. I'm not going to try to carry too terribly much with me. I'll come back and check this area later. that All right. Here we go. All right, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, so, hold on. Follow these tracks, that's what I need to go. That's a big anomaly right there. I see you. to be absolutely certain. Oh, that's a freaking spider.
don't like this. See that anomaly. <sighs> Come on, Pat. You jumped onto my damn knife. Both jumped onto my damn knife. Okay. I'm gonna heal up a little. <clears throat> there we go. Hi, bitch. I see you. What the shit? see what I got hit by. Come on. I need to be much more careful. Dude, this is where I need to be. Old people without family to take care of them used to live in this village. I knew one of them, a woman. One of my kindergarten teachers. She retired and moved out of the city just a couple years before I finished school. She could have retired earlier, but she was working with children. So, she couldn't be on her feet so many hours of the day. I don't think she had children of her own. I used to visit her at the kindergarten and later out here. She was hunched over and wrinkled but as commanding as ever. I wonder what happened to her. She died, of course, but how? What were her final thoughts? I hope she was at peace. I spied a bitch. I deserved it more. I believe this is the house I need to go into.
the shit? Hi. I believe that's probably going to be my thing that I need. going to be in there. Well, apparently my knife dissolved like a fart in the wind. Let's see if there's anything. Oh my god. Somebody living in here was a fucking prepper. Someone living in here was a big time prepper. By the way, I do apologize for visibility or lack thereof in this game for the moment. I do know that there is an item that I do know that there's an item that once I've got it, I essentially am able to
Okay. There's an item that'll increase my visibility once I've got it. Okay, I need to go that way. Something over here I know is going to try to kill me. <clears throat> oh, you're the one that was going to try to kill me. Looks like it'll lead me somewhere. Let's do it. Whoa. Whoa. New entrance, I guess? Oh, well. This is about all the time we got uh, for this episode. I'm going to just turn in this mission really quick. That light. Okay, so I'm going to need my security level upgraded later. Anyways. If you enjoy the gameplay or the commentary, or this is where we're going to leave off. So, if you enjoy the gameplay or the commentary, give us a like. If you want to keep up with this or any of our other content, hit surprise. Uh, surprise? Surprise! <laughs> hit subscribe and ring the bell. Become part of our notification squad so you can see when we upload and when we go live. But for now, this is Kit the Solace signing off. So, until next time, everybody. Bye bye! Mlem.